Segway. Shalom from Israel. Here in the Judean Hills, we have our encouraging word for the day, and it is out of Psalm chapter 37, verse 23 and 24. And it says, Yehoshua directs a person's steps, and he delights in his ways. His way. His way. There's only one way. <laughs> he may stumble, but he won't fall headlong, for Yehoshua holds him by the hand. You know, this is incredible. When you read it in Hebrew, it starts with Be Yehovah, which means actually by the Creator. Because in Him, when we're walking according to His ways and we're walking in obedience, He knows better. He's like the perfect dad. You know, some of us may have had a dad, maybe not had a dad, maybe had a dad that just wasn't the perfect person uh, in our life. But the Creator also has a, an aspect of Him who is just the perfect Father. And it says that in Him, when we're walking according to His ways, He won't let us stumble. And you know, that, that word, um, to fall is tool in Hebrew, which means to like literally fall on your face. Like, like it's not even you just fell on your knees. It's like you were on your face and you're just broken. And you know, sometimes in life, uh, we get destitute, we get discouraged, we get depressed. Uh, you may have had a business and then your business plans failed or you had a certain you know, dream that you thought that that is what you wanted to accomplish and then it doesn't get accomplished. You know, but, but he does not let you fall completely to the ground to where you cannot pick, be picked back up. That word stumble rhymes with humble. And what I think of is that uh, when we stumble, we may trip and fall onto our knees. And so he may humble us and that's a good thing, but we won't fall headlong. So we're not gonna be smacking our face. So it, we may get our scuffed knees and daddy will pick us up and brush our knees off and give us a kiss and say, it'll be okay. And that's a good thing that we be humble, that he humbles us. We need to ask for his humility so that, um, so that we can glorify him and be refined in our hearts. We want pride to be far from us because humility is creator's favorite fragrance. So be encouraged today. If you feel that you have fallen on your face because of the circumstances of the world or family or or a business failure or venture fail, whatever it may be, you think you failed. Just know that Creator has not let you fall completely to the ground to where you're broken into pieces and unable to rise back up. And, He's there to pick you up. And it says, He delights in His way. Well, His way, um, in other words, the person who whose steps are directed by Yah delights in His way. His way, Derech, His way is Yeshua. Mm -hmm. the way, the truth, and the life. He is Haderach. And so uh, we, we can delight in Yeshua. And don't worry, the scuffed knees will come. But verse 24 says, Yah is holding us by the hand. By the hand. Like the creator daddy. of the universe, the master of all things, the giver of breath is holding you by the hand. How incredibly compassionate is that? So Heavenly Father, we just lift up the person who's watching this video right now. Mm -hmm. We ask you that you would guide their steps, that you would um, direct their steps, that this person would delight in your way, Yeshua the Messiah, Haderach. We ask you that even though he or she may stumble and get scuffed knees, thank you Father for the humbling process. Let us wear your sweet perfume of humility um, to attract you closer and closer to us. Mm -hmm. And we ask you that you would keep us from falling headlong and that you would hold our hands, hold the hand of the person mm -hmm. watching this. And Father, we just bless you. We thank you because you're amazing. You're incredible and we thank you that you're there when we fall. You're there when we stumble and you're there to pick us right back up. And Father, we just thank you and I ask that, that blessing on every single person watching this, that if they have stumbled, if they have fallen, if they feel they can't get back up because they're under the weight of depression or weight of, of, of um, defeat, Lord, that, that they learn to look up to you, to walk according to your ways, or walk according to your commandments. If you love the Creator, walk according to His commandments. And there's so many blessings in doing so. And this is one of them. And remember that when you stumble and when you um, scuff your knees, just ask the Father's forgiveness. Lord, I fell. Please forgive me. His blood, the blood of the Messiah, 
covers over all of our offenses and we just need to apologize. So we thank you, Father, for your forgiveness through Yeshua, your son. Yes. Many blessings, Seneco Kakona, Gagwakia Kasika Bo Yeshua, many blessings in the name of our great chief, Yeshua the Messiah.